Okay. So, clearly my Wi-Fi died. I, I did say that connection issues <sighs> were bound to happen. Uh, we are back. Uh, just gonna give it a few minutes. Uh, just to test it out, just to let people come back in, you know, stuff like that. I am terribly sorry. I'm gonna let people come back in. If you guys are in chat, please say something so the stream's working, so that you guys are there. All of that. gonna get ah, very stressful day today not good I'm just gonna let people come back in Hey, welcome. Welcome back. I am very sorry. My Wi-Fi is unstable right now. I at least want to make it to, like, the first part of the story. I, I, I've been dying to stream this game, guys. Like, I've really been wanting to uh, play through the new story, experience all the new events. I've been so excited for Inazuma. Like, the moment it was announced, I've been so hyped. I've been so hyped. And then the power went out earlier. How nice. And now the Wi Fi is not good. It's still lagging. Okay. <sighs> Sorry if I miss anything. It means my computer shut down. It's fine. Uh, we're probably going to miss a lot considering how bad my Wi Fi is. <laughs> Totally not angry. <laughs> okay, here we are. And now let's move, let's move on. Let's start. Let's start the cutscene again. Oh, the fleet was fully up to the challenge. The inclement weather still caused some delay. Now then, let me introduce everyone. This is Toma, a trade partner that I've Toma. Been to know recently. <laughs> you don't know how long I've been waiting to see you. Toma, Ooh. You two are Oh, no need for introductions. Their reputation precedes them. It seems even the stormy sea can't keep rumors of these outlanders' stirring deeds at bay. So even though we've never been to Inazuma, this guy already knows about us? Uh, nice to meet you, Toma. <laughs> oh, it's sure nice to hear you say that. <laughs> With any luck, it'll give you a head start here. Thomas resided on Rito for quite some time now. It wouldn't be going too far to say he's the fixer around these parts. Mm. If you run into any problems here, just talk to Toma. But if he tries to pull any moves on you, I'll be sure to deal with him personally the next time I'm around. <laughs> no need to worry. I'm sure we'll get along just fine. Good. Then if it's all settled, I'll be going. I wouldn't want to be caught with my sails down here. <laughs> I want a fugitive on board after all. Ah. Uh. Oh, right. Traveler. Until next time, traveler. Remember to give it your all, no matter what perilous storms you may encounter. Wait, Beto's already leaving? Kind of excited for her in the story. Looking forward to see you at uh, seeing you again, Beto. Oh. Uh Kokichi asks, anyways, how have you been? I'm okay. Like physically, I'm, oh, um, we need to go get you registered at the border checkpoint. Um, kind of thought we were supposed to be keeping things on the down low. Are you just gonna walk into the government's hands? <laughs> <laughs> Don't underestimate the reaches of the Sokoku decree. You wouldn't be able to avoid inspection even if you tried. So we have to play by the rules, even if we're kind of bending them. 
Okay, then. Do I get to play now? Okay, cool. That scene's over. So, uh, anyways, uh, somebody, uh, how have you been? Uh, I'm okay. Uh, I feel okay. I'm just really stressed out with how, uh, stream's turning out lately. Uh, wasn't able to stream yesterday, but it was alright. I, I had fun, uh, personal stuff. But, uh, today, clearly, uh, a lot of things going wrong. Okay, here we go. Oh, there, Miss Kageyama. All right, let's just begin this. <laughs> Hello? Please state your name, identity, and the purpose of your visit. Oh, we accept you, Toma. <laughs> you must be new here. Eh. <laughs> <laughs> Please provide the information requested and also declare any goods you are carrying with you. Uh. We're here to trade wine and ore. We, I don't, I don't, I don't want to give the truth immediately. Like we don't know if this person's good or not. Currently, <laughs> only members of the International Trade Association are authorized to engage in the import and export of goods. Do you have your traders permits? Traders permits. <laughs> My apologies, but I'll have to ask you to. Here are the entry papers for your time perusal. <laughs> I just wanted to see what you'd say. Sorry about that. I see. Okay. Your papers are all in order. Welcome to Rito. Rito. Okay. Where do we go now? The Outlander Affairs Agency. Uh, they only check entry permits here. If you want to remain on Rito, there's a process you have to go through with them. Sheesh. So in Paimon Sheesh? Paimon Sheesh? Forget that to everyday folk in Inazuma, people from everywhere else are referred to as outsiders. As the word suggests, outlanders aren't very welcome in Inazuma with the Sokoku decree in force. Not even on Rito, where they've established an outsider settlement. Welcome or not, we don't have a choice. <laughs> I like how you think. I've got a feeling we're going to get along very well. <laughs> now, let's head over to the Outlander Affairs Agency. That was kind of cool. Most of the current rules were put in place by the administration of Rito, the Kanjo Commission. Oh, this place looks nice! Wow. Yes, one branch of the Tri Commission of Inazuma. Responsible Let's explore a little bit first. Ooh. You really haven't heard of it before? Lavender Melon. It's new. Let's collect these things first, guys. <laughs> Plenty to see. Plenty of time. Hope. Hey. Here. Oh, and some artifacts. Okay, so... Hey, our first steps into Inazuma! Look at this, look at this, it looks so pretty! Look at the trees, wow. Okay, okay. Oh my god, I'm actually amazed. Oh, sir? <laughs> Where'd you come from? I don't remember this guy being here. Oh, he was the guy standing over there. I want to see his design. I I'm sorry, I'm getting distracted. Oh, this guy looks cool. Look at him. Look at him. Big old samurai boy. How, how tall is he in comparison to, like, Dai Look? Oh, wow. He's taller. Okay. <laughs> I'll leave him alone. I'm in for a lot, you say? Okay, okay. Oh, welcome. Uh, Eduardo Cardozo. I hope I didn't butcher your name. If I did, I'm very sorry. But, uh, yeah. Welcome to stream. You look like a new name. So if you're a new viewer, uh, welcome. Wow, this place is so nice. It's actually very nice here. They're all speaking at once. <laughs> wow. Oh my god, look at that. I I'm just admiring like the scenery and all the architecture. Oh, oh. waypoint, waypoint. <laughs> Let's go! I don't even mean to find this. Our first Inazuma waypoint, guys! Let's go! <laughs> wow, there looks like so much to do. There's this one uh, uh, Genshin streamer that uh, Pete Peek recommended to me. His name is Tectone. 
he said one of his expectations or like one of his wants for uh for the Inazuma update is to uh to feel like you're in a completely new area. Because let's be honest, Liyue and Mondstadt, they are different, like, architecturally, but everything kind of feels the same all around. Like, since we've explored it many, many times. I want Inazuma to be a place that feels like, where the hell am I? I am lost. Someone please save me. You know, and I'm getting that feeling right now, in a good way. <laughs> What's my TikTok again? It's just a general flamingo. No numbers or anything, nothing special. Oh, this looks like the uh, the area in the, the trailer where, I, I don't know what her name is, it's one of the pink-haired girls, I believe. She was standing right where she is. Alright, so here's the uh, inspector. Right, <laughs> it's a bit funny playing as, you know, the Geo Archon here. <laughs> right, let's get on with this. Wow, this place is nice. You've completed the entry procedures, yes? Mm -hmm. and you want to apply for residency both of you yes ma'am <laughs> okay the processing fee will be 2 million mora what 2 million for a processing fee are you serious yeah, she's got to be joking right guys 1 million per apple no 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 oh my lord don't worry you can trust my math Two million Mara, guys. I can. The highest I've ever reached is like one thousand. Uh, no, one thousand. Sorry, one million uh, six hundred thousand. And like, I burned through all of that in a day, leveling up Eula. Not in a day, in a week. I mean, my apologies. This has to be a joke, right? <laughs> Hopefully, it gives some give some like story money. You know, we don't actually have to use our Mora. Wow. Yeah, come on, Toma, back us up. Toma, it's you. By way of courtesy, <sighs> allow me to reduce it to four hundred thousand more total. That's still quite expensive. You don't say so. Thank you so much, Miss Eureka. Miss Eureka. This is just a processing fee. I think six hundred more should cover it if I'm. <laughs> yes. Yes, six hundred more. Consider too. How does that sound? Yes, Toma, save us. <laughs> Fine, Mom. Wow. <laughs> Much obliged. <laughs> Sorry, Paimon. Keep your mouth shut. Okay, I don't actually hate Paimon. Uh, I'm I'm not like the other people who are like, ooh, Paimon, be quiet. Ooh, Paimon, so loud. No, I actually love Paimon. Adorable. But like this time, Paimon, keep your mouth shut. This guy's saving us. Reminds me of someone else's strange relationship with Mora. Hmm, I wonder who she's talking about. It's more than the Mora. I'll say this one because it sounds funnier. Chad Toma? True. <laughs> processing fee is just a figure of speech. The way some here at the agency see it, the fees are easy money. So it becomes a question of how much they can make. So is this like tourist scams? Do you guys know, like, uh, let's say New York, for example. There are these guys in New York. It's a very well-known tourist scam, actually. Since New York uh, City, like Times Square especially, yeah, Times Square, uh, it's a heavily packed place filled with foreigners and travelers from all around the world. People from uh, everywhere, right? So there are these guys in like, like uh, Toy Story outfits or like uh, Elmo, stuff like that. Like those specifically I remember. I'm pretty sure the Elmo guy. Like uh, they'd, they'd call you over for like a picture. You know, they, they'd uh, be a little aggressive with it actually. And then, like, uh, you know, you take the picture with them, no charge or anything. And then the moment you take the picture with them, they're like, they, they start demanding money from you. You know, <laughs> like, they get really aggressive with that. They demand money from you just for being in your picture. That's, that's a very, uh, uh, what's this? Well-known tourist scam in the uh, New York Times Square. Anyways, let's, let's continue with the story. Just, th just thought I'd share. Aww. Exactly. It's at times like this that having a local friend really comes in handy. Blatant aggression against outlanders. That's literally what I'm saying here. <laughs> yeah, when you're 
entered Inazuma, far from home in this closed nation era, there's very little that can be done about it. He does have a fair point. That overseas merchants can do to look after themselves is stick together. That's how the International Trade Association came about. He's got a point. So it's a trade association built by and for Outlander? Yep. And as well as advancing commercial interests. The association provides help, support, and structure for Outlanders trying to survive on retail. Essentially, it's an association devoted to both commercial excellence and survival skills. The raid in Shogun feels further away than ever. Uh, sounds like you're staying alive as an achievement when you're an outlander in Inazuma. True. <laughs> I see. So this is the real purpose of your trip. Yes, given that you're outlanders, it's certainly a lofty aspiration. After all, the Raiden Shogun is the most exalted and revered one in all of Inazuma. She is a deity who reigns on high, while all other life gazes up in awe. Still have to find a way. I was going to say nothing is set in stone when it comes to who you will encounter in this world. Who's to say you won't happen to run into the Raiden Shogun one day after lunch? <laughs> uh -huh. And is there a flight for it? I did. Okay, I'll give it to you straight. I know of a way to introduce you to the Raiden Shogun. Ooh. Really? Wow, the real victor is better connected to me, Bob. <laughs> I mean, it will take all the resources I have at my disposal, but it could be done. However, before we get there, connections come at a high price, you understand? Oh no. Uh, not you too! <laughs> same, Paimon, same. No, no. In this instance, when I say price, oh. I'm not talking about Mora. In fact... Better not take my primos. It's just that, if this is something you really want, You'll have to agree to help other people solve some of their problems first. I like to do things oh. that keeps everybody happy. It's my own personal rule. I'm on cutie. <laughs> this. Sounds very reasonable to Paimon. Paimon's a baby. Middle, so you have to trade favors to keep everyone indebted to you. Wow. <laughs> so, what's the job? <laughs> Gonna eat? <laughs> Alright, see ya, holy fire. Here's the situation. As I touched upon earlier, the members of the International Trade Association are constantly struggling to survive. <laughs> Recently, things seem to have gotten more difficult than ever for them, so just go and check things out. See if there's any way you can help. The head of the association is called Carissi, and he's a good Carice. friend of mine. Go talk to him. I'll wait for you here. Gotta talk to Carissi now. <laughs> hey. Please, go ahead. That guy? Hello? Oh, this guy, this is Ting Ting. <laughs> Igor? Oh, there he is. Kurisu. Look at, look at how snazzy he looks. I've never seen a fedora in this game. <gasps> Wait, we can speak to this cat? This cat has a name? <laughs> Meow? Oh, look at that. It mailed back. It mailed back, guys. Let's go. This is this is the this is the update we've been waiting for. This cat. Oh, camera's going wonk. <laughs> this cat is the update we needed. Thank you. Thank you, Kaiser. All right, let's talk to Karisu. New cutscene. Oh. Hello there. You must be seeking refuge with the International Trade Association. The Outlander Affairs Agency took you for all you're worth, I suppose. <laughs> Luckily, we had a friend with us. Ah, oh, good. That's a relief. You need to be careful, or you'll find yourself losing your savings all at once. We heard the Association has been having some difficulties lately. Is that true? Yes. Left, right, and center. Obstacles at every turn. But that's nothing new for us. Well, the Kaku Decree certainly makes things difficult for anyone who wants to come here from overseas. But it's not the root cause of our woes. The Sokoku Decree might restrict our scope of activity, but in and of itself, it doesn't stop us from being able to enjoy a comfortable existence. No, what's really squeezing us outlander merchants dry is 
those Morok rebels from the Kanjo Commission. Oh, of the three commissions, that's the one that oversees everything on Leto, isn't it? That's right. They impose astronomical tax rates, unbelievable regulations, and that's not the worst of it. They just issued a new tax decree recently that, oh. for some reason, completely changes the way we pay our taxes. It used to be Mora, but now it's something called Crystal Marrow. Crystal Marrow? What's that? Ugh, something that most of us in the association had never heard of before either, until the new decree came along. <laughs> Eventually, one of the older Liyue merchants recalled that he once shipped a batch of it to Snezhnaya in his youth. So, in order to pay our taxes, we began an arduous search for this crystal marrow. But then we found we'd only managed to create a bigger problem for ourselves. The rising demand for crystal marrow is see. priced higher and higher. <sighs> now there's only one vendor who even has it in stock. We can't get a hold of it anywhere else. And This uh, almost sounds depressing. <laughs> This vendor keeps pushing the price up, and we have no choice but to buy from them because the tax decree forces us to. It's a vicious cycle, the consequence of which is that our taxes will soon exceed our profits. And once that happens... <laughs> this is absurd treatment. Yeah, screw this government. Government sucks. This is a nation where the cries of a few struggling merchants will never be heard over the ever-present roar of thunder. <sighs> Fontaine, my dear homeway. Fontaine. I see an awful lot at the moment. That place. <laughs> You're really bleeding them dry. So what do you think we should do? Um... Negotiate? Besides, I think this may well be the fate they've ordained for us. Okay. Well, we could try tackling the problem by going to the other party involved. Uh, that vendor. I've actually done business with him in the past, but after a point he stopped contacting us. I have no idea where he sources this stuff. Hmm. Well, it definitely sounds like he's being unfair. How do we find him? We can go talk to him. See if he lets anything slip. Hey, that's a pretty good idea. <laughs> Since you're not affiliated with the association and you're new to Rito, you may just let guard down. Ooh. If I remember correctly, our usual meeting point with him is under a tree by the coast in the residential district. See if you can find him there. Got it. We're on the case. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, sir. All right, so uh, cutscene's over. I can talk again. <laughs> uh, how are you guys doing in chat? Uh, I'm gonna ask from time to time as usual. It's kind of my thing. So it's, uh, it's a really easy chat interaction. Wow, I think it's so nice here. Finally, morning time. We get to appreciate this even more. Ooh, is that the crystal marrow everyone's raving about? <laughs> Werner. Remember another guy named Werner? I think it was in Mondstadt. Right, stuck to this guy. Huh? I don't think I recognize you. Are you new arrivals? Um. <laughs> yes, we just arrived. So, what do you need with me? Where do you source your goods? You're a sheer nerd. You don't go around <coughs> asking questions like that. If I gave you my sources, I might as well hand you the whole darn business. Trade secret. Got it? You know what trade and secret mean, right? Oh, this guy's... <laughs> exactly, Paimon. Paimon, we think alike here. <laughs> you reduce your prices? <laughs> Are you even buying? Oh, I see what's going on here. Karisu and his associates sent you here to try and plead their case, didn't they? <laughs> They're wasting their time. The price is non-negotiable. Not by a single <laughs> mora. This guy's kind of annoying. They're lucky to be buying from me in the first place, and they ought to be more grateful. If it weren't for me, they'd be in seriously hot water. What are we gonna do? We have no trust in this guy. Um. 
Yeah, let's get Toma. <laughs> Okay. Uh, screw you, Werner. <laughs> Honestly, can we just like destroy this guy and like <laughs> steal all the crystals for ourselves? Ooh, is this a new type of wood? Cool. Just you like some of that while we're at it. All right, uh, let's go back. Wow, this place is really something else. Where are we on the map? Uh, oh wow! Oh, there's a there's a statue near, nearby. I actually do want to get that first. We can have a mini map. Let's go before we talk to Toma. Pretty sure we can get there, right? Ooh, nice. Hey, what's up, Nexcon? <laughs> Uh, my Wi-Fi is not so good right now, so stream might be laggy. Uh, it cut off earlier, actually, which is really annoying. I'm uh, exploring the new update. Seems pretty cool so far. I'm doing the story quest right now, but uh, just cutting it off a little bit. I want to get the uh, statue first so I can have a map. I, I can't climb that, really? Come on, Eula. <laughs> Show me your five star? Sure, sure. All right. Uh, character archive. So I'm a free-to-play account, so I don't really have everyone. I don't expect me to. Uh, this is my favorite character. It's pretty obvious. I don't want to watch because I want to play it later and not get spoiled. I'll just play your stream in the back. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> uh, I appreciate it, even if you're just lurking. Okay, so uh, here's my Eula. Uh, let's go to our details. Let's go over here. Uh, oh, we can't see them. Okay. Maybe I'll go to character instead. That'll make a lot more sense. Will you pull for Ayaka? I did one ten pull, uh, just for the hell of it. But really, I'm actually saving for Ball. I really want her. She's Electro, so I have a feeling she'd be good with Eula. Uh, I, I hope she will. Superconduct, you know, she's physical damage. This is my Eula. Uh, here's my build. Uh, artifacts. Download. Okay. Uh, not Not the best, but it works for me. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, the Archon? Yes, the, the Electro Archon. I really want her. Honestly. Uh, stats. Alright, uh, this is Dialog, my first 5-star. Uh, I'm still working on his build. The only proper build I have is on Eula, really. Uh, I have him at C1, actually. <laughs> I, no, I didn't lose 50-50. I just pulled on a standard banner and I got pretty lucky. Uh, here's my Zhongli. Uh, tenacity of the Millilith. I do want to rebuild them sometime, though. You gotta eat? Oh, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Alright, I'll just keep showing for uh, everyone else here. Uh, here's my Zhongli build. I badly need more crit damage, clearly. Uh, it's pretty average build. Uh, here's Barbara. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's not worth looking at. Yeah, yes, yes, Barbara. Uh, I have not put any effort into building Barbara, clearly. Uh, Traveler. Okay, five stars. We we want to see the five stars, right? So, Yula, uh, Dialog, Zhongli, and, uh, oh, some people are gonna get mad at me for this. Zhongli? <laughs> Zhongli, don't, don't interrupt me, sir. <laughs> sir, do not interrupt me. Thank you. Some people are gonna get mad at me for this, but I have Tartaglia, and I have not built him at all. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I got him at the same time as, like, Zhongli, and uh, I ended up choosing Zhongli over him, and I kind of just got, really. It was also around the time when I quit the game, so uh, there's there's Tartaglia. I think that's all the five stars I have, so Tartaglia, uh, Zhongli, Dialog, Yula. oh, oh, and Chi-Chi, Chi-Chi, don't forget. <laughs> I forget a uh, little baby Chi Chi. <laughs> okay, so uh, let's continue. Let's look for that statue, huh? Shouldn't be hard to miss. Gotta be. Ah, there it is! Let's go, our first Inazuma statue. Ooh, look at this, guys. God, even the grass looks different. Everything is differently. Wow! Wow, wow, oh my god, wow, okay, wait, I did not expect that. Oh, 
This is a lot prettier than I thought. What is that up there? Oh my, welcome back, Holy Fire. Uh, did you enjoy your food? <laughs> look at this! This looks amazing! Oh, look at that, there are cranes there. I won't kill them. I don't have an archer on my team right now. Let's do it, guys. Our first Inazuma Statue of the Seven. The world opened itself before those with noble hearts. <laughs> wow, that's a lot of water. Okay, so we unlocked the statue of Narukami Island. Wow! This, <laughs> this is amazing! It's so refreshing to see a new map. I know we just got the archipelago, but, but still. This is amazing. Wow. So this is where we are. This is all, all we've been to. It seems pretty cramped. You know, like, uh, compared to the open areas of Mondstadt, the high mountains of Liwe. But I guess that's just because this is uh, Rito. You know, the entrance area to Inazuma. At least from... Good. Oh, why is this... Everything looks so interesting. Oh, there's a... In Azuma City, there's a there's a city here. Look at this, Mari. Welcome, welcome to the stream. Uh, this this is my first look at In Azuma. <gasps> you know what I was saying earlier. I really hope they bring back the the Wave Riders. What do you know? They're back. Oh my God, this this is gonna be amazing. I'm gonna have so much fun here. Ooh, new boss, new boss. Perpetual Mechanical Array. I've seen this boss in the trailer. It's, it's like the spider thing. Or the, the jellyfish thing. I think that's the one I can like shapeshift and stuff. Okay, let's let's continue. I'm just... Oh. Yep, Statue of Seven. How many do we need? I heard we need like 140 Electroculus. Christ, I am not ready. Uh, for your information, guys, I have all the Animoculus. And all the uh, geoculus. It took a week to find everything. Yep, the spider thing. <laughs> New ruin enemy, I believe. Type of lizard? Oh my god, everything is amazing! Everything is so new! This is what I've been yearning for in the game, because all I've been doing is building my characters, doing the same domain every single day, grinding ley lines, but... It feels so nice to explore a new area again. I feel like I just installed the game, and like I'm exploring Mondstadt for the first time. Look at all of this, guys. All the new people. Oh, Thomas back. Hey, hey, buddy, you want to help us? <laughs> all right, cutscene. Mm -hmm. That was quick. You've resolved it already. Huh. Actually, we're having a little trouble. You're gonna have to help us help you. <laughs> no? Well, by all means, tell me what you need. I'll help as much as I can. Getting you to go fixing things when you've only just arrived is quite a demand. Uh, what do you know about Werner? Oh, that guy? I'm familiar. He used to be a bit of a sorry sight, selling shells that he'd collect on the beach just to get by. But he seems to have suddenly shot up in the world recently. I can only assume he must have found himself a patron after leaving the International Trade Association. He's an outlander too? <laughs> yes. Couldn't you tell when you spoke to him? I knew it! I knew he was from Mondstadt! Huh. <laughs> Werner was born in Mondstadt. I knew it. The shipping business, trading between His name was so familiar. When Inizuma closed to the outside world, he was one of a group of outlanders that ended up stranded on Rito. The International Trade Association was initially very generous to him, but over time, with decree after decree, the association members found it increasingly difficult to make ends meet. So he left the association <laughs> and turned his back on them. Wow. <laughs> I'm sure it's more nuanced than that. I believe even the most ungrateful and cold-hearted of people still have some amount of gratitude and warmth left in them somewhere. Go back and talk to him again. <laughs> Well then, it sounds like you may have found a way in with him. <laughs> Wi-Fi seems to be a lot more stable now. I hope I didn't just jinx it, but uh, yeah. 
My, uh, my internet speed doesn't seem to be dropping. Thankfully. Alright, let's go back and find this Werner guy. Ooh. Thing here. Could it be? Oh, it's just a radish. <laughs> Sir, I'll take your entire stock. <laughs> what are you doing back here? Just because I got plenty of time on my hands doesn't mean I want to waste any of it talking to you. I really don't like this guy. Let's let's be passive aggressive. <laughs> time in your hands. Some would call that a form of freedom. Giant gay, welcome back. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> a dandelion wine would sure be nice on a day like this. A bard serenade. Osmanthus wine tastes the same as I can remember it. <laughs> we were talking about Mondstadt. In a zoom pog. Oh, Dewey boy. Hey, hey, hey. Welcome. Oh. What what are we doing? I actually have no idea what we're giving him. Wine. I don't have wine. Can I get past the ruin? I haven't fought it yet. Don't spoil anything for people who've played this already, by the way. I don't know what I need to give him. Give him some of those. I don't know. Take that. <laughs> Goodness, I can sense it now. So familiar. Wow. The last time oh, now you're nice to me? <laughs> May the Anemo Archon protect you. Oh, my hometown. The home of freedom. How I long to go back and visit. <laughs> All it took was a wolf hook. Oh, uh, <clears throat> trying to play my heart. <laughs> there, are you? Oh, I see. I get it. You can't get past the quest to actually access the new region. I see, I see. Uh, what is this? What are you up to now? <laughs> Listen closely. Doesn't it sound familiar? You mean the sound of the ocean? <laughs> Cheap and tasty chop suey. <laughs> oh, that's good. I can see it so clear. Mm -hmm. Oh, and the sound of the waves, the calls of the merchants. May the flames of virtue spread to all, never be extinct. Ah. Uh, Shell lanterns. Ah. Uh. I'm right there at the lantern right. <laughs> into the sky this this makes me sad i didn't get to experience a lantern ride festival and i regret it i quit the game at this time and of course it just had to be during the best event in the game come on <laughs> ball will possibly kill me too soon my reaction time sucks Ooh, boss fight with her no oh, don't don't answer that i don't know <laughs> i wanna i wanna be surprised <laughs> hmm, what am I willing to give to this guy? <laughs> give him some chili. <laughs> Wait, stop. That's enough. <laughs> Don't make me relive it anymore. My poor heart can't take it. A lot of people out there sympathize with the position you're in. You mean the folks from the International Trade Association? And I suppose they are far from home, just like me. Often, I'll sneak down to the shore at night and listen to the sound of the waves. I like to imagine it's the voice of my hometown, carried across the <laughs> ocean. I've run into folks from the association more than a few times doing just that. But I always hide my face and slip away. <sighs> Don't you think I've wanted to talk things through with them and free myself from this ambush? Um, well, no one's stopping me. <laughs> Why one does have a point again? They're so resilient. None of them had anyone else to rely on, so they rallied together, committed to finding a way to survive. But I couldn't do it. I'm not strong enough. So I caved. Those people. They'd make the smallest of promises, offer the most measly benefits, and I'd do whatever they asked of me. And make Mondstaders look like the worst people in the world. Damn. Damn, that's mean. <laughs> Not nice. The whole story. It's eating me up inside, and I can't take it anymore. 
Okay, Mr. Werner. Hmm. The International Trade Association will protect you. But I betrayed them. I can't show my face there. Okay, <sighs> Mario's a bit low. I'll turn it up. But now it's time to make things right. So uh, I turned it up. Uh, tell me if it's better now. What's the deal here? It's a scheme by the tax collection Ashigaru, Keijiro and his companions. They start by overtaxing the merchants. Then take the extra crystal okay. marrow they receive. I can't turn it up more pirate. if you want. Once the merchants run out of Just places let me know. to buy crystal marrow, they get me to sell that extra stock back to the merchants at an extortionate price, with the proceeds going to the tax collection Ashigaru. It's just... It's plain evil gouging them like this. I'm their puppet, yes. But my cut is a tiny fraction of what we take in total. It's barely enough for me to live on. We need evidence. Evidence? Hmm. You're right. Without conclusive evidence, he will never admit it. Now <laughs> that I think about it, whenever I report back to him after a sale, he always heads to the same place. That's pause. always made me suspicious. Okay, I'm gonna read chat uh, for a bit. Uh, you said the volumes, uh, I mean, the, the quest is too hard for you? Uh, you could look at some guides to uh, character builds. So that you could like uh know what you're doing, you know, maximize your damage output, stuff like that. Uh Dewey Boy says you could hear Paimon all along. What do you mean by that? <laughs> also, uh yes, I do believe I have the achievement where you mess with the volume. As it happens, I handed some Mora over to him not long ago. I, I can show you where he went if you want. Really? Yeah, let's go, Paimon. <laughs> okay. Oh, achievement name. Okay, I get it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I got that one. Because I tried getting it when I saw like a video about it. And I didn't get it. So it just must mean that I got it already. Right. Next cutscene. Yep. <laughs> A lot of cutscenes here, but we gotta get the exposition so we know what's happening in the story. Keijiro, Ooh. It's him. After him. <laughs> oh, it was a quick cutscene. Do we actually have to chase this guy or Oh. Oh oh oh. Follow without being noticed. Okay, okay. Gotta lay low guys. Gotta blend in. <laughs> Deeky deeky. We haven't had like a stealthy mission like this in a while. Not really stealthy, but like one where you gotta hide or something. Ever since like the first like uh missions. My laptop died while I was playing the game in school. Rip. Hey. Oh! That actually scared me. What the heck? Did not expect that. Wow. Okay. I thought he was gonna sit down and it would trigger a cutscene. Blend in <laughs> the bright Oh. I was looking at chat. I was looking at chat. Hey, 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 come here, come here. Oh, okay, cutscene. We reached it. What was that sound? What? What's going on? Do I have to do it again? I was looking at chat. I couldn't see how close I was. <laughs> I think I gotta do it again. Yeah, okay, okay. Yeah, just skip this. Okay, we just gotta follow. Nice and slow. Two. Slow. <laughs> totally don't stand out at all. Like, totally, I'm not one of the most well-known people in all of Tevet right now. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> From up here. Ryoko, how's business? Ooh. All the better thanks to your generous patronage. Ooh, okay. Good. Thankfully, I earn plenty these days. <laughs> oh, but of course, tax collection is difficult work. Okay, okay. Wait for him to go down and then we move again. We're slowly becoming the antagonist of the story. Ooh. Oh. Get him! Get him! Hmm. What was that sound? 
Oh, what? I thought he was running. Oh, he is running. Okay. Go, 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 go. Don't tell me I have to do it again. Are you kidding me? Oh, bro, I'm bad at this game. <laughs> I'm so bad at this game. Is it because I'm sprinting? Like, does that count as too much noise? Yes, yes. Okay, Jiro. Okay. <sighs> Slow and steady. I'm not gonna rush it. That's what I said last time, but, you know. Maybe the dash noise. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Maybe I can't dash. Which one should I choose? <laughs> Sneaky. Right, maybe we don't gotta follow his exact path, you know? We, like, hide over here and stuff. Let's drop. You didn't like this part of the quest? <laughs> I think it's fine. I just think it's a little confusing as like uh, what counts as being spotted and stuff. I don't mind different gameplay mechanics like this. Good. Thankfully, I earn plenty these days. His voice sounds familiar. Is he gonna run again? Okay. Now. Oh 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 oh. Oh, he's not. He's not fine, on. Okay, we just gotta stay extra far. Oh. Okay. Hmm. What was that sound? Quiet! Don't let him find us. Okay. Must be hearing things. Ah, <laughs> behind schedule. I need to hurry. He's getting further and further away. Hide in the bushes. Come on. He's right there. What do you mean, where'd he go? Don't make me restart. Paimon, I swear to God, he was right in front of me. Paimon. Paimon. If only we made less noise. Yeah, yeah, right. Do I just have to walk the entire way? How did you do this, uh, Holy Fire? I didn't dash. I literally, like, jogged towards him. Ugh, <sighs> man. Kejiro, it's him. <laughs> True. Do heels not exist in Inazuma? <laughs> no, there are heels right there. Look at that. How close do I need to be? He's gonna hear me immediately. Go there, Holy Fire. Do you know what I should do? I remember it on walking just behind him. Okay. Walking like this or like jogging like that? Go. How's business? <laughs> All the better thanks to your generous patronage. Right over here, just like last time. Thankfully, I earn plenty these days. I'm gonna memorize the script before I finish this. Tax collection is difficult work. It's gonna say something. Now, who else is behind on payments? Let me think. Yes, the trade association click still needs to be brought into line. It's not like I get enough customers. He's getting further and further away. Hmm. What was that sound? Quiet! Don't let him find us. Must be hearing things. Ah, drat, I'm behind schedule. I need to hurry. He's getting further and further away. Let's catch up a little. Paimon? Paimon? He's right there. And see him, Paimon. Please, please, be the end. Oh, yes! <laughs> oh my god. He was right there a moment ago. Seems he disappeared in a blink of an eye. Paimon, be quiet. If only we made less what could noise. Do oh, is this a glitch? <laughs> Paimon's glitching. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna have to eat by like around 8 o'clock or something, by the way. Next payments. Is this the Pyro Fatui of Inazuma? <laughs> Walks up with a sword and goes, You can't run from dead. <laughs> you know, maybe. Mm -hmm. 
What could this be? Dig. N nice digging. Ah, uh, yes, the real reason Paimon came along. <laughs> Aww. Let me take a look here. Ah, yes. This is what we're looking for. A clear and complete record of every single transaction, each one proof of his guilt. This feels too easy. Why would he just leave this here? Great! Well, now we have our hard evidence. Let's go tell Carissa the good news, shall we? Uh, um, I'll... I'll say goodbye to you here, then. I... I need a little more time before I'm ready to face the head of the association. I'm sorry. Huh. Poor Werner is a pretty awkward guy, huh? <laughs> well, Werner, we started hating you, and now you're, you proved to be kind of useful. So, thank you, Werner. Tell the International Trade Association about what really happened. Alright, let's go straight to it. <laughs> I wanna see, what can we buy from here? Can we buy from this person? Mm, oh, there's no buy option. Alright, goodbye. Uh, goodbye. Okay, here we go. Man, this place is pretty. I'm pretty sure we could buy from here. This has to be. Right? This looks like a shop. Nope. Can't buy from here. I'm just dumb. What about here? Sailing Breeze? Nope. Damn, we can't buy these drinks? Huh, whatever. Alright, let's get on with it. Uh, hey, here we are. Oh, wait. The guy's here. But we really don't have anything left. If this <gasps> keeps up, our sales will come in at a loss. There'll be nothing left for us to do but starve. You know the decree. The rules are the rules. No discounts, no exceptions, and no excuses. You're the only one making a mockery of the rules here, Keijiro. And who are you? Another new member of the association? It just so happens that we found your little ledger, so now we're here to tell everyone all about how you embezzled Crystal Marrow to sell it right back to the taxpayers. Hmm. Quick question, how many crystal cores do you have? I have zero. I've been crafting so much condensed resin. Huh? Is this true? You've been swindling us. Well, uh, you, you, you see, the, the ta taxes, uh... Yeah, that's well, right. Look at the ledger. Pretty soon reads through each and every item in the ledger. Well, would you look at that? Every hmm. payment the association has made is right here in your personal ledger. So, ah. Mr. Keijiro, it seems you have some explaining to do. How shall we settle this, hmm? Hmm. <laughs> So you think you could easily take you down? No, not it's really a strong wave. <laughs> simply stating that it would be quite a pity if an illustrious gentleman such as yourself were to have their reputation tarnished. Ooh. <laughs> well, even if what you say is true, what do you suggest we do about it? I believe you still have a quantity of crystal marrow in your possession, correct? Mm -hmm. Perhaps that crystal marrow could be used as compensation for the recent tax hike. And us merchants could finally have some more breathing room. Is that it? Oh, do you have any idea the hoops I had to jump through to get the crystal marrow and keep it hidden? Ah, oh, fine. In that case, I'll send it over to you today. Huh. And not even an ounce of shame for his actions. Yeah. So that's it? My shop's been closed for weeks now. I've even had to ask my friends to help bail me out. What about my losses? Come on, Harrison. We've already struck a good deal here. I'm sick of being pushed around like this. I will let him off so Harrison. Hey, what's all this racket? Does uh -oh. someone dare question the decree? Ah, Chief, you've arrived. What was all the commotion I heard just now? Oh, we were just discussing a minor tax issue. I do my utmost <laughs> to lend them a helping hand. Someone's afraid. They're never grateful. A helping hand? The only thing you're doing is stuffing your greedy pockets with our hard-earned wealth. Ooh. <laughs> I assure you that Hirage Shinsuke will hear of this. 
Oh, and you dare to utter the Commissioner's name. You outlanders have no respect for the rules. Seize the merchants <gasps> and resolve this dispute oh, no. back at headquarters. Oh, oh. This is going in a bad direction. Gentlemen, Can we fight them? Oh, okay, Toma. <laughs> for this. If there's a dispute to resolve, let's get a drink and talk it over. Who are you supposed to be? And why in my right mind would I join you for a drink? <laughs> <laughs> you never heard of the fixer? Context, fine one. Context. Here's my card. Huh. You're from the Yashiro Commission. Shh. Huh. Well, this is Kanjo Commission territory. Yashiro Commission may be. You have no business meddling in Rito's affairs. <laughs> of course not, of course not. Still, perhaps you could show the young lady... Oh. That just cut... What is that? <laughs> is that a fan? Give our clan some courtesy. Oh! You wouldn't want your name showing up in a petition to the Shogun, would you? I think I know what he's talking about. The Shirasagi Himegimi. Oh, I know who she is. I know who they're talking about. With her. <sighs> okay, let's forget all this. It'll give us one less thing to worry about. But chief! Enough! We're leaving! Yeah, that's right. Okay, soon, gentlemen. My treat, I insist. <laughs> uh, no response, huh? I suppose that bridge is well and truly burned then. Yep. Thank you so much, Toma. But I'm sorry your relationship with the Kanjo for sake. <laughs> hey, hey, I was joking. It's a small price to pay, and you're more than welcome. If there's anyone you should be thanking, it's the Traveler. She's the one who found a way to turn things around. <sighs> if nothing else, I'm sure the tax collection Ashigaru will tread a little more carefully in the future. Toma, look who's all that up! Shh, shh, not here. Too many people listening. <laughs> Let's move somewhere <laughs> else. Your friend got called a furry for liking Toma? What the hell is furry about him? Where are we going? Talk to Toma. Oh. But let's go somewhere else because too many people will hear us. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> nice one, Toma. <laughs> Corruption seems rife in the Kanjo Commission. Surely. They truly are rotten to the core. <sighs> All right. It's time for me to answer your questions. What would you like to know? Tell me about the Yashiro. <laughs> Straight to the point. Let me reintroduce myself. I belong to the Kamisato clan of the Yashiro Commission on Narukami Island. I'm an attendant of the Shirasagi Himegimi. You've been keeping your true identity a secret from us this whole time? So, the Yashiro Commission. Guessing that's another branch of the Tri Commission? Correct. The Kamisato clan is the head of the Yashiro Commission, oh. who manage ceremonial and cultural affairs. I'd go into more detail on what exactly that covers, but I'm not even sure myself. I'm just someone who was fortunate enough to be taken in by the Kamisato clan. My role is to take care of the daughter of the clan, Kamisato Ayaka, also known as the Shirasagi Himigimi. Seems like she must be super famous in Inazuma, given the reaction of those guys just now. <laughs> oh, most definitely. She's graceful, dignified, and kind-hearted, too. The people of Inazuma quite adore Miss Kamisato. No way to meet her. Her fame even somewhat eclipses that of her older brother, Kamisato Ayato, despite the fact that he's the current head of the clan. I suppose those who treat others with compassion earn themselves the same treatment in return. Miss Kamisato's situation certainly seems to attest to that. Take me, for example. I'm just an attendant, and yet she treats me as an equal, as she would a friend. So, as her attendant, are we helping you or her? You're asking the right questions. And, to be honest, I don't want to keep you in the dark any more than is necessary. Firstly, you should know that being a fixer is not something you can fake. I spent the better part of a month tirelessly building up a network of relationships on the island. And I got to know Captain Beto during that time, too. Still pretty good going for just a month's work. <laughs> well, maybe I have a slight knack for schmoozery. But the main thing was, I had to make sure I'd be in time to receive you when you arrived. Inazuma may have closed off to the outside world, but that hasn't stopped a lot of people from hearing about your feats in Monsta and Miu. 
So, when Miss Kamisato heard of your intention to come to Inazuma, she began looking forward to your arrival with great anticipation. She's excited to find out whether the rumors are true. That is, that you have what it takes to change the tide of the times. Change the tide of the times? In the test I gave you earlier, Same. although there were a few hiccups at the end, it was you who found the way to turn the situation around. Navigating powerful people, using their character flaws to your <laughs> advantage. It's just what Miss Kamisato had hoped to see. With your help, even the Vision Hunt decree... Hey, what are these options? I do kind of want to help. This is... Aw, oh, man. I don't like these options. I'll go with the... The nicer one. Ah. Uh, hmm. That's an unexpected development. Perhaps our sources were misleading. Damn, Trevor. Okay. I have one goal here. Meet the Raiden Shogun. Yes, of course. I completely oh. understand and as agreed, I shall help set that up for you. Wait, but I did want to help. Toma sure didn't put up much of a fight. That actually makes me sad. <laughs> <laughs> well, my work on Rito is done. So I suppose this is goodbye Aww. for now. Oh, uh, one more thing. This invitation letter is for you. When you get to Narukami Island, you can find me at the Komori Tea House, as per the letter. Good luck with everything. See you soon. Dang. That actually made me really sad. One problem. Outlanders are unable to leave Rito. Must be the next part of his test. Oh, darn it! No wonder he was so matter-of-fact about the whole thing! <laughs> Soon as we get off Ritu, Paimon's going straight to Kamura Tea House to settle the score! Uh, well, guess we should give it a try. Let's head to the border and see how far we get. Okay, another cutscene done. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, we completed the first quest. Nice! Um... Huh. Where can we go? Let's see these things. Wow. There's a lot to do, and that's not even the entire thing. How big is this in comparison to, like... Leeway. Leeway is, like... About the same size, but it's mostly water. Okay. Uh I guess I could do the first bit of this quest. I thought I would I thought I would actually like finish that quest at like eight o'clock or something, because that's when I plan to eat dinner. But uh go well, out. We got about twenty minutes more time. Um Try to leave Rito. Alright. Let's try and leave. We could easily take on this guy. You know, just one press of my Q and this guy is dead. Like immediately, but but okay, okay. Apparently, we can't do that. <laughs> Stop there. Present your travel permits. Sorry, but we really gotta get to Narukami Island. It's kind of urgent. If you don't have a travel permit, this is as far as you'll get. <laughs> Those are the rules. Good, we gotta get one. As expected. Yeah. Traveler, you gotta think of something. How do we get out of Rito? if the Yashiro Commission has heard of us. Well, Yashiro. Are you saying we should go and meet with the Kanjo Commissioner? Guess it can't hurt to try. Even if Paimon has a few choice words to say about his subordinates. The entire... Oh, yeah, I'll pause. Our biggest fan. <laughs> uh, Holy Fire says, Oh, well, the entire available story is really long. Ooh, I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> uh, Orange is back. Welcome back. Uh, Pog, you're still streaming. Yep, I'm still up. Uh, I will be eating at around like 8 o'clock. I'm pretty hungry. <laughs> but, uh, I do want to play through more of this. I'm having a lot of fun. I'm getting invested in a new story, guys. Awesome. So happy that this uh, update came out way sooner than I expected. Alright, let's continue the cutscene. <laughs> How are you guys in chat doing? 
You guys uh taking your dinner yet? Or uh breakfast or lunch or like whatever meal, depending on your time zone. I'm asking dinner specifically because most of us here in chat are from the Philippines. And it's a little over above uh dinner time average schedule, you know. Ask uh wait, go to the Kanjo Commissioner's office to ask about a way to leave Rito. Okay, simple enough. Oh this guy gonna gank us too. Alt. This is the Kanjo Commissioner's office. No trespassers. Sir, I made it here I made it through here earlier to get the statue. You didn't stop me that time. I didn't get stopped last time. Orange says, uh doing fine, just a dinner. Hope you can eat soon too. Thank you. It's close to dinner. It's 7.43 p.m. Yep, same time, same time. The Kanjo Commissioner seldom entertains outlanders. Leave now or we'll be forced to... Ah, wait, wait, wait. Oh, Commissioner! These two are honored guests from afar. No need to give them the usual spiel. <laughs> hmm, come on in. Let's see what we can do for you. Huh. Did you get all that? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> M my sincere apologies. But I thought that man's just disappeared. He's actually just gone. Oh, faces back into reality as one does. Honored guest. You know what? All you guys in chat, all y'all are honored guests as well. <laughs> are these primo gems, bro? Bro, give me the primos. <laughs> You're also hungry, but also tired. Uh, oh, I think my Wi-Fi died. Oh, hello. Uh-oh. That's bad. Yeah. Okay, it's still running. Um. Uh, give me a moment to check my OBS. <laughs> I'm still live. We're good. We're good. Okay. Yeah, it stopped broadcasting for a while. It actually scared me. Let me just uh check my OBS for a sec. Pick up the settings again, just in case. All right. Uh, let me close. It's just laggy. Yeah, I, I I had the thing closed. My bad. All right. So um, I am Hiragi Shinsuke. I hope I didn't put that. Audio lagged for a sec. Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> Kanjo Commissioner and head of the of the. Hiragi clan. It's an honor to meet you both. I too am honored to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you, sir. So, the reason we wanted to come and see you was because... Alright, alright, all in good time. Two travelers renowned far and wide have shown up to see me, and I should very much like to make their acquaintance. Let's not limit this to business only. <laughs> So what you're saying is, we really are pretty famous, huh? <laughs> Next con says, Hello, I'm still lurking. I want you to know this, Mr. Mingo. Mr. Mingo? <laughs> Mr. Mingo, what a name. I've never been called Mr. Mingo. <laughs> Absolutely. How many other people in the world have what it takes to knock the wind out of Storm Terror's sails and put the overlord of the Vortex back under the sea, <laughs> eh? This guy Canadian. That's Jay. And I hear you also foiled a Fatui plot in Liyue Harbor. Even beat one of their harbingers in a duel. Yep. Is that true? Us. Whoa, you heard about that too? Uh, yep. It's true, all right. Hmm. As I thought. It's catchy though. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. I'm simply awestruck by you both, is all. You're too kind. Rito is greatly honored to have you visit us. One other thing I heard about you is your great zeal for helping other people. Hmm. This makes me wonder uh -oh. whether you might be so kind as to render your assistance to the Kondro Commission. Uh oh. <laughs> This is my forte, Excellent. indeed. Well then, you must know the Qingxin, a flower oh. grows on the mountain tops of Liyue. I have plenty of those. Yeah, we've picked a few of those before. So, uh, do you want <laughs> us to go back to Liyue? Yes, 
bring me three what in, would you freshly picked I mean no way Did hear that wrong? they don't say fresh after they're picked <laughs> hmm? too much trouble is it hmm I see then how about this we have a few items that need delivering Perhaps sounds way better that? that sounds much more like it yeah 709 letters to Jesus Christ <laughs> hey, what gives? How come you don't have people to do that already? Terribly sorry. We're just a little short on people lately. What sort oh. of an explanation is that? Oh, who's this? Traveler, what are we going to do? Should we really help this guy? <laughs> I don't know if I'm on. Oh. Person just nodded yes, AO. Consider it. That's the spirit. Don't keep me waiting too long now. <laughs> hey, the other English VAs tried to copy Paimon's voice. It's funny. I heard Zhang Li is actually. <gasps> oh, oh, ho, ho! You see that up there? Is that gonna be our first uh, Electroculus? However you say it. Okay, let's bring let's bring a Geopappy up here. <laughs> okay. Go, guys. Get our first one. Yeah. Oh, my. How do you climb these roofs? Okay, let's try and going up here. But there's a chest up here, too. No, no. More stamina, Pog. I heard it doesn't give more stamina. I don't know, though. I don't know if that's true. Hey, how am I gonna do this? The back? Make sure you have your interactive map on for it. Yeah, I know. Thank you for reminding me. Get up there. It doesn't award stamina. Yeah, I heard that. How do I get up there? Can I Can I get lucky and put a... Hmm. Yeah, I don't think this is going to cut it. Uh... Uh... You guys know how to get this thing? <laughs> Oh, maybe, maybe right here. Ah, okay. I'm, j I'm just dumb. It's gotta be here, right? Oh. <laughs> Mr. Zhongli. <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> That's honestly really funny. Oh. You have venti? Nah, I don't have venti, sadly. Hey guys! Oh look, he's looking at it. It's a nice shot. First, Electroculus. Electroculus. Electro thingy. All right. Electroculus. That's how I'm gonna say. It. You didn't realize this way? How did you do it? I just got pretty lucky and noticed, like, wait a minute, this is a wall, I can just climb. You have to use Geodra? <laughs> I see. I thought, oh wow, is this impossible? I'm like, no way, you have to be able to do it without certain characters, right? <laughs> oh man, okay. Our first Electroculus, guys. Uh, I have about 8 minutes left in uh, how long I want to go. So, let let's do this. Let's just finish this up, and then maybe... We could wrap it up with something. I'll probably start my outro, like, after the, these cutscenes. <laughs> uh, who's this guy? Oh, this coming. Huh? What did we do? Miss Hiragi has a letter for you. She oh. insists that you read it immediately. Okay, step one, have venti. <laughs> Ooh. So this means she wants you to um, secretly meet her at night. Still playing. Guys, let, let, let me read. I'm on. <sighs> Don't forget to mark it. Yep, I got you. Mark it, don't worry. Um, get a glance. <laughs> Have you been up to something behind Paimon's back? Oh. Hmm. Let's ask her tonight and see what she has to say. Okay. Is that another quest? Uh, okay, I think... Okay, the stream's been running for, uh... Well over an hour. Yeah, an hour and 18 minutes. 
So I think it's okay for me to leave it here. Uh, Inazuma is beautiful. Honestly, I love it. Oh, <laughs> need a trip like that. How to get Venti, step one, have luck. Or step two, be a whale. Oh, is there a little note? Little note? Steal that. Okay, let, let's sit here for the outro. So, uh, yeah, uh, I'm gonna have to end stream here. It's uh, getting pretty late for me. Uh, uh, excuse me, wow. How unpleasant of me. Uh, step two, wine. <laughs> True. Seem a lot different with uh, either MC. True. Uh, oh yeah, the letter. I didn't get to read it because uh, Paimon is talking. Oops, I accidentally closed the game. Uh, inventory. It should be here, right? Or is it just a one-time thing that I'm gonna never be able to read ever again? Here's it. Is it here? Is this it? Aw. Guys, I don't, I don't see the letter. Huh. Oh. oh! Is this it? Oh, no, no, this is it, right? Yeah. Dear Traveler, would that, what? Would that I could convey this message to you in person? I apologize for the hasty means by which this letter has come to you, and I hope that it isn't, that it hasn't left you feeling perplexed or perturbed? Perturbed? What? I've never heard of this word. Perturbed in any way. This is my first time extending an, invi an invitation to an unknown outlander, after all. It is no mere coincidence that our paths have crossed. Therefore, I hope that you would be so cautious as to meet me tonight, under the glow of the resplendent moonlight. Please do not fret about retainers and bodyguards. I will ensure that their attention shall be elsewhere. I look forward to the pleasure of your company. Nice. Okay, yeah, uh, I'm gonna have to uh, close the stream now. Uh, I'm getting pretty tired. Uh, and Azuma's been pretty fun. I'm, uh, scenes now. Uh, yeah. So, not much else to say here, really. I'm gonna close the game now. <laughs> uh, not too many viewers this time, but I did really enjoy, just as always. It, viewers doesn't matter to me as long as I'm streaming, talking to you guys. <laughs> yeah. So, let me play my little outro song. Still loading, still loading. All right, yeah. <laughs> All right, I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. Uh, we'll be ending it now. Amazing stream, Jen. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> uh, thanks for tuning in, uh, new viewers. Uh, Dewey boy, I haven't seen you around in a while. I'm pretty sure you're uh, through, right? <laughs> uh, next con, thank you for lurking. Orange, thanks for tuning in, even though. Uh, you don't want to get spoiled. Holy Fire, thanks for watching while exploring in Azuma. Uh, thanks, thank you everyone, Giant Gay, everyone. <laughs> and Kokichi, if you're still there, I hope your your laptop doesn't shut off, you know? Gwen as well, thank you for always watching. It's because of you guys that I get to do this stuff. Like, I, I do say, of course, the views don't matter, but they, they, they matter in a good way. Like, the negative stuff, having low viewers, that doesn't affect me, but when you guys are here, it really motivates me to keep streaming, to keep pushing. <laughs> I was honestly really sad when the uh, the power went out earlier. You don't wake up early enough? Ah, uh, yeah, I'm sorry. Different time zones. I stream at like 2 in the morning for you guys. They're in New York. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, that concludes today's stream. Um, by tomorrow, I'll either play Genshin again... Or I'll be uh, streaming another game. Uh, hopefully another horror game. Either that or I'll go back to I'm on Observation Duty, you know, try and finish the second night. Uh, I will save up a little bit, I guess, for the other other games that they have. I'm on Observation Duty, because you guys seem to really like that one. But yeah, that's it for me. Thank you for tuning in. Until next time, guys. <laughs>